Hello and welcome to Punch and Pick channel. Today I'm going to show you how to use Aircrack Tech NG to hack a Wi-Fi network. Disclaimer, this video is for educational purposes only and do not try it to use it to hack on any other people's network. If you are a new Linux user, you will have to uninstall this tool because you are not going to find it built in in your system unless you're using Kali Linux. We're going to install the tool by running down the command sudo app-git install aircrack tag ng. As you can see guys, I have already installed it. Or you can simply get it cloned from the GitHub. In order to start, I need to put my Wi-Fi interface in the monitor mode. The Wi-Fi interface differs from machine to machine, so make sure that you run down this command sudo fconfig to know the name of your Wi-Fi interface. In my case, it's WLO1. Now I'm going to put it in the monitor mode. Soto Airmon Tac NG, and then the name of your Wi-Fi interface. Yeah, and start. As you can see guys, it says that there are four processes that they need to be killed, so we can just run down this command, sudo airmon tag ng check kill, and it will automatically kill the current processes and put the interface in the monitor mode. It takes less than a minute. Right now, we will run down this command again to make sure that the Wi-Fi interface in the monitor mode. As you can see guys, the name of it has been changed to WLO1 mon, which means that it's in the monitor mode. Now we're going to run down this command sudo aerodontac ng and then the name of our new Wi-Fi interface. This command is going to make our Wi-Fi interface run a quick scan to see the whole nearby networks. As you can see guys, Ctrl C when you can find your Wi-Fi. Here I can find my Wi-Fi on channel 11 and this is the MAC address of it. Now we're going to run down this command sudo aerodon tag ng and then tag c for the channel and as you can see my Wi-Fi is on channel 11 and then tag tag PSSID and then the MAC address of my Wi-Fi here's the listed MAC addresses just copy your Wi-Fi MAC address and then tag W and then the location that you want to save the files in that it's going to be captured in my case I'm going just to, you to save it on the desktop for a new Linux user right click open the terminal and write down the command print working directory and copy the directory that you are in currently here we go and then slash and then the name of the file I'm going to name it handshake you can name it whatever you want and then the interface w l o one mon check as you can see right now it starts to count the user in this network and everything in order to capture the handshake file i'm going to communicate with the router with a command called sudo air replay tag ng and then tag 0 to 10 this is the number of the packets that I'm going to send to the router in order to communicate with it to give me the handshake file tag A and then the MAC address of my network which is here okay copy it paste it here and then the name of the Wi-Fi interface wa 11 As you can see guys, after communication the handshake file has been captured here. Now we can simply Ctrl C to stop it. As you can see guys, 
The handshake file has been captured here and the password of this Wi-Fi network is encrypted in this file. You can simply just crack it by using any cracking tool like manually crack it by the crunch tool which is coming with the aircrack dash ng i'm going to list that in another video by running a view brute force or just you can use a dictionary thank you guys for watching and don't forget to like